Hi there Aquarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm going to be doing your June 12th through 18th weekly reading. This is going to be a general reading. If it turns out to be a love reading, so be it. I will let you know. Um, thank you to all the subscribers. I really appreciate that. Um, if this doesn't resonate with you, check your uh, moon sign or your rising sign. If you're looking, if you are looking for a private reading, you can find the information below that will lead you right to where you need to go. Again, this is for Aquarius, June 18th, <laughs> June 12th to June 18th. Um, yeah, so this is a general reading for Aquarius. Dear God, spirits, angels, and universe, what do you have for Aquarius for the week of June 12th through June 18th? This is for Aquarius. What do they need to know? upright. I don't know if I told you this, but sometimes I do reversed and sometimes I don't. It all depends on my mood and how I feel and all of that. And right now we're doing upright. Um, I get the, pretty much the same message. Very accurate. It's not really an issue. <laughs> all right. Oh, so this is June 12th through the 18th. It looks like you are feeling... Um, like you've been wounded okay you've been wounded and here you are Aquarius you're right here in the beginning of the week you are remaining confident and strong all right perhaps you've just gotten over a battle and now you're feeling um, wounded okay this is the beginning of the week June 12th 13th um, yeah, we're going to do a lot of clarifiers, so we'll get more on this. Um, but this is you, for sure. This is your sign. It's saying that, you know, you're, you're, you're okay. You're all right. Whatever's going on, and you're fine. Um, perhaps you're, you are now um, working more as a team with somebody. Um, there's more teamwork, all right? There's more collaboration going on. This is at the beginning of the week. Moving towards the middle of the week, and it looks like it, the situation is a lot calmer. So whatever was going on last week is now um, calming down. All right, and then towards the end of the week, it looks like you are you're coming out of isolation, whereas you might have needed a, quite a bit of time to um, go within. You know, it looks like you are coming out of isolation. All right. Um, and then there's a reconciliation and you're feeling quite um, quite abundant by the end of the week you're feeling good okay so at the beginning of the week you're feeling kind of not so good and by the end of the week you're feeling really good um, so that's pretty good There's your confidence, okay? You go from having a wounded end of the week last week um, to bringing yourself back, okay? You start to bring yourself back. Um, you're, you have a lot of courage, you know? You're strong, confident. And this is saying to keep doing that because it's working for you. <laughs> okay, this is perfect. So again, at the beginning of the week, um, you you are working as a team with somebody now. It's no longer just a more of a, you know, 60-40 or 90-10%. Uh, it's a team, okay? All right? So now it's more of a, let's collaborate to get this right. 
um, and um, once you do that, you will have re you will have reached a point where um, you're very very happy. Okay, once you can get through this and become a team. You reach a point where it's very good. Very, very good. <laughs> Looks like you've been still been worried. I don't know why. Um, we're going to find out. Okay, so here you're being confident. This is the beginning of the week. And you feel like your everything is finally coming together, and your happily ever after is, you know, there. You're feeling like, phew, this was a big point. This was a big pivotal point, and we've passed it, you know. So now we can actually get to our happily ever after. Um, no, I don't know if this is work related or relationship re re related. We will get right back to that um, towards the end. I'll be, I will know for sure. This is um, being very practical, okay? Being very practical. It's, again, connected to the team, all right? So it's being, and it's about money. So these two cards are about money and stability and security, okay? Um, trustworthy, okay? Respected. I just keep going back to this. Once you work together, it's gonna it's gonna be very very good, and that's why this card is here. Um, then you're gonna move to calmer calmer um, feelings, a calmer atmosphere. It's gonna be calm. Um, there's the troubled waters over here. You know, there's a little, and this card is now below the troubled waters. This is just clarifying all the worry that you've had, okay? This is the troubled water. I mean, you've been very, very worried and uncertain, okay? And that's why you've been isolated, but you've decided to, to step out. You're no longer going to stay in that spot. Maybe it was just for a few days, but you've decided to step out, okay? And because you've started to try to started or whatever, stepped out, um... There's a transformation, okay? It's a big deal. It's a big deal, okay? This is a pivotal moment. It is. It's a pivotal moment because you're no longer working alone. Something has happened previously that has caused you to feel, you know, hurt, wounded. Like, what the hell just happened? But you are a very confident person, okay? You're a very confident person. You have a lot of courage. You, you don't... Uh, hold grudges per se you move on you know if you have to cut somebody out fine you cut somebody out but then you keep going you it's not like you're gonna cry over it for a week so you're very um confident um and you work on finding a solution okay so that's that's who you are you work on finding a solution and i think you do find a solution and it causes a lot of happiness okay and a lot of joy um and you know this is this is um honesty trustworthy practical okay so it is it's really good okay it's a message of perhaps people trusting each other and working together with this one and and things getting calmer and you've been pretty worried about it you're coming out of isolation now you're going to have a big transformation you are. This is a big transform. Leaving something, maybe an old part of yourself. Okay, that's what I'm getting behind. Leaving something behind and moving on. And it is a. This is a past. Okay, so leaving a old past to behind. So some, you know, that's okay. These are both nines. Okay, and they're right at the end. So this is love and money. 
you're almost at the ultimate. This is perfect. It really, really is. These are like almost completions, all right? So, this is ideal. Ideal. This transformation is needed for you to get this. This could also be somebody from the past, okay? It could be somebody from the past coming back. Um, which is, you know, a new start. And you need to look at it as a new start, okay? That's how you need to look at it. That's really good advice for you. If whoever comes back, if they do, you know, this may or may not resonate with everybody, but whoever it is that comes back, you need to look at it in a new light, okay? Look at it in a new light. And remember to work as a team. All right, even if you've been wounded, because this has potential for really, I mean, this is your wishes come true in love, and this is your wishes come true in abundance. I mean, come on now, this is ideal. Looks like the rainbow. At the end of the rain, you know, when the sun comes out. I mean, that's what just came to me. Because, you know, you had some rain. You had some stormy weather. You did. You had some stormy weather. But uh, you got through it. Or you're getting through it. And there's some pretty good advice here in these cards. Seven of Cups. It says Seven of Water, but it's the same. Ace of Wands. That's very good. Very good. Um, two of Swords. Okay. All right. Well, this is good, too. Okay. So, up here at the beginning of the week, it looks like it's a complex decision. That's what this is. Um, stop procrastinating. All right. So, you're used to doing things on your own. You are. You're used to doing things on your own. And, uh, you're used to being the leader. You're used to, uh, calling the shots, okay? You're used to calling the shots. And people just, you know, come together to, um, work for you per se whether they work for you or not but you pull people together to um, get the job done um, so anyway this seven of cups a complex deci decision the need to do research stop procrastinating teamwork collaboration you might have to be the one to suggest it or you might have to be the one to change. Okay? And it's not easy. It's not. Um, but there's a lot to consider, okay? There's a lot to con A lot of things that you, when you're thinking about uh, making a transformation, okay? When you're thinking about transformation, make sure that you think about everything. Okay, because that's options. The Seven of Cups is about con all the things that you have to consider. I mean, it's a it's seven. So at least come up with seven. <clears throat> come up with seven things that you need to consider for your transformation. Ace of Wands. Ace of Fire. And exciting, and see, you are a fire sign, and that, and... There's a lot of fire here. Okay? There's a lot of fire here. So you're definitely very um, strong this week. An exciting new opportunity. Career advancement. Change your life now. So that's what, that's what this card says. But it doesn't have to be career advancement. But I do think it is. I think it is career advancement. Um... Or career recognition. 
all right? If it's not about career and it's about love, then it's a love advancement. It's a love, um, it's a step in the right direction, okay? In the direction that you're looking for. Um, and it's an opportunity handed to you from the universe, okay? And it's right over this calmness and these, this worry. So, and it's about growth. It says change your life now. That, that's, at the, that's at the end of the card. You need to change it, okay? You need to change it to get rid of this worry. It's up to you. Then we have the Two of Swords. And I'm sure, sorry that I don't sugarcoat anything. Um, I tell it like I see it. It may not always be pretty or what you want to hear. But that's the way it is. If it is pretty and it is what you want to hear, great. I'll tell you that. But if it's not, then I'm not going to tell you that. So, it's just the way it is. I tell it like I see it. Um, two of Swords. Being unable or unwilling to make a decision. Pretending there's no problem. And I think... Pretending there's no problem. Perhaps your advice. This is the transformation. This is you coming out of isolation. This is about, this is about change again. That's how it's been. You have been pretending that there's nothing wrong. And that's why you need to change. That's why it's over here. Because you can't pretend anymore. You can't. I mean, you can't. So... That's what this is about. You. Well, it should be about you. Um, I think it's about love and work, actually. Because, um, you know, they come, they, they come together. I think it's about you changing something big. Something big. That will enhance your career and your love life but it's all about you all right and it's good because you go from being wounded to thinking about it and coming up with a solution and really thinking about it to um working as a team collaborating listening to each other and then it feels real good it feels like oh thank god you know there's harmony now and then, um, and it's practical, okay? And you guys are going to trust each other, all right? And it's going to be calm. And it's an opportunity. It's a new beginning, okay? It's a new beginning because you did this. And, you're, and it's a new beginning of growth with love, because we have quite a bit of love here, and with prosperity, all right? So that's what it's about. I mean, there's really nothing else to say other than you have the chance, chance for um, big things, big, big things. You have the chance for complete success in, in uh, abundance, security, stability, and in love. So you have that chance. But there's still a little bit of work because these aren't tens. And they're at the end. Even though you have this 10 here, this is about this situation. This situation. Feeling great about this. All right, Aquarius. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, thank you to all my subscribers. Uh, that's it. <laughs>